Okay, super nice feature in here also is that there is a screen door that can close here. So it's just stashed right over here on the side. Um, I recommend this. I mean, this thing just runs on a little track on the bottom and the top. I recommend always having two hands when you open and close this just to keep it so it doesn't, you know, catch on one side and start tearing. Um, you also want to make sure to keep the track kind of clean of dirt and stuff. So if it's not closing or opening all the way, just make sure that this track is kind of cleared out of any debris. And then you can just close this. Push both the top and the bottom nice and snug and you'll get a nice snug fit over here so no bugs will come into the vehicle. You can just leave it like this at night when you sleep, if you like, and then you have some nice cool breeze kind of coming through. There is also a screen for the rear of the vehicle. We keep that right up here in the top and um, I'm gonna go ahead and pull it out and then we'll go to the back and show you how to use it. Okay, and the screen for the back there's little little tabs up here at the top. You just insert the, the fitting and then twist the tab to hold it in place. There's about five of them up here on the top. And then there's a Velcro along the side here that you can just Velcro this piece right in to the side of the van. And then the centerpiece, make sure the Velcro is not too tight on you. The centerpiece is just a magnetic strip and you can kind of, if this has been sitting too long up in the top up there, it kind of gets a little bent. So you can just kind of rework these and reshape them. And then these will magnetically stick back together and close for you. And that way you can have kind of a screen door set up if you want to sleep with just open air.